Hey guys, Ancient Warrior, welcome back to Prepping in Free America. If you like what you hear here, hit the subscribe button. If you want to be the first kid on your block to know what craziness we're talking about next, hit the bell icon with all. Hmm. And leave comments, folks. I'll get to them ASAP, which means generally within 24 hours. And if you want to share this video, show your friends how crazy the old man is, send it to, send it to Facebook, send it to you, uh, to, uh, to uh, Twitter, or Instagram, or wherever you want to put it. I don't care. Guys, the story is starting to fall apart. The Ukraine story is falling apart on the Biden White House. Why am I saying that? I believe the president of the Ukraine is is uh, Zelensky, and he said that Biden has ruined the American economy. Now he's working on the Ukrainian because they've lost over $500 million due to all this talk of war. The angry prepper had a, uh, not angry prepper, but uh, Canadian prepper gave his take the other day on on the Ukrainian situation and I listened to it sounds pretty good I went down here and talked to my friend who came to the United States from the Ukraine and he still has family over there and I asked him I said are they getting geared up for war and he said he said from what he's being told it's business as usual. Folks, the only place you're going to hear about all this blasted war rhetoric is from the Biden White House. You know, the Biden White House reminds me of the Brady Bunch. You remember that TV show from the 70s? The second girl in line's name was Jan, and she was always having problems with her older sister. You know, Jan used to go, Marsha, 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 Marsha. Well, Jan Biden, you know, Joseph Jan Biden, is... Russia, 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 Russia. And I'm sick and tired of it, folks. For five years, all through Trump's administration, all we heard was Russia this, Russia that. My problem here, guys, is not with the Russian people. It is with our White House. They're warmongers. They're trying their best to destroy our economy. I got news for you folks. China has already told the U.S. leave the Russians alone. Zelensky came out and said we have a treaty in place with the Russians. But no matter how much evidence you show an idiot, he still won't believe it. That's this White House. That's Austin, Millie, Pisaki, Harris, Biden, the whole kit and caboodle of them. Winking, and blinking, and nod. Guys, 
we, each and every one of us, need to tell our leaders, our congressmen and our senators, that we're tired of war. We don't need another conflict. You know, this genius in the White House, on his first day, killed the Keystone Pipeline. Also made it harder for exploration on public lands. Then started buying, buying oil and gas from Mexico, from OPEC, the Saudis and from Russia. Does he think that if we're, we're going to slap the Russians with a bunch of uh, sanctions, they're going to continue sending us that much needed fuel? But here's the problem. You know, guys, two years ago, we were energy independent. Guys, I am sick and tired of the warmongering coming out of the White House, out of the Democrats and the rhinos. We don't need to be paying as much of attention to Russia as we do our own problems. Now, I was looking at some pictures the other day from one of the other channels and there was a picture of a boy holding this funny looking kite and the caption said boy flying a kite made of banknotes Germany 1930 Is that the way it's going to be here in the United States? Have banknotes, kids making kites out of banknotes? We need to get our house clean, folks. We need to clean our yards up. And our yard extends from the Atlantic to the Pacific, from the Canadian border all the way down to the, to the Gulf the Mexican border. We need to clean our house. Folks, we need to sit back and understand that our country comes first. Let everybody else worry about their own problems for a change. With that being said, I'm the ancient warrior. It's better to have this stuff and not need it than need it and not have it. And remember, if you're prepping, you live in free America. I'm the Ancient Warrior, and have a blessed day.